Welcome to another Stanley Community College Academy Sports Center tutorial. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about checking the packet tracer skills environment for your students before they take exams in your courses. This is important because without the packet tracer skills environment working correctly, some of the questions inside of the chapter exams will not appear uh, or work for your students. So I want to show you a quick way students can check their packet tracer skills environment. So first thing we're going to do, I'm going to go into Netacad and I'm going to go into a course and your students will have this available to them at the uh, first page of the course and that is the student resources. If students click on student resources this is where they download Packet Tracer. It's also where they can perform a Packet Tracer skills assessment environment check. So you click here and it will then ask for a, in my case I'm using Chrome so it actually asks me do I want to keep the JNLP uh, item or file so I do and then I click open and at that point, Java opens, and this is because uh, Packet Tracer, excuse me, Chrome no longer supports Java natively. It kind of has to go out into a different environment to, to allow it. So you actually get a little pop-up saying, would you like to, to play this? Click Run. It will then run the check and will provide you with an output that shows whether or not your particular PC is able to run the Packet Tracer skills assessments that are inside of the chapter exams and also the packet tracer skills assessments that are individual items that are assignments. So it's going through, in my case, checking um, my packet tracer environment, and I will get a report here in just a moment. So here we go, it's gathering information. And it takes a few minutes, obviously. Okay. So the check is now finished and you can see that the ports are 100%, the browser is Chrome, I can download the files, it tells me what my JRE version is, runtime environment, operating system, uh, available ports, and it says it meets the minimum requirements to, to contain and run the packet tracer activities. If this fails, you may need to reinstall Java, you may need to reinstall uh, packet tracer, the, the most recent version, which is 7.1. I would suggest anytime you reinstall Java, uninstall Java completely and then uh, reboot your machine and install the newest version. Likewise, with Packet Tracer, do the exact same thing. Uninstall Packet Tracer, all versions, and then reinstall with the latest version after a reboot. I hope this has helped, and this is something you should have your students do before taking any exams in your classes to ensure that the Packet Tracer skills assessment environment works correctly. Have a great day, and if you have any questions, always feel free to contact us.